Alright guys, how's it going? Got a little package here from Blade Ops. Let's uh, dump it out. Right. Okay, we got a Magnum Boca, but we'll get to that another day. Today, it's about the autos. Oh, we got a sticker here from Blade Ops. Uh, if you've never shopped at Blade Ops, uh, I recommend checking them out. I'll, I like I like uh, using Blade Ops, they're really good. Oh, they sent me a little little uh, badge there too. They always look after me with little knickknacks. Um, Alright, so what we got? We got here... Uh, let's do the... Here we go, this is what we've got. We've got the Bokeh Cleaver. Made in Taiwan. Let's take a look at it. There it is. I love these boxes, the AK-47 boxes. Alright, come on out. Alright, here it is. Look at that blade there. Big old hump on it. Let's rearrange the camera a little. Alright, so here it is. Now these have got aluminum handles. I, I like I like these knives, they're great fun. Let's shoot this one open. There we go. Look at that blade. I got this one for, I don't know, I was thinking barbecues, just slicing up tomatoes and whatever. Handy round the barbecue there. Nice rounded off blade. Bit of jimp in here, up there. Uh, yeah, just your ordinary body to your bulkhead knife. This one's in OS 8. Yeah, good and sharp. Feels pretty darn sharp. And there's their serial number there. They like to serial number their knives. I like their clips. Some people don't, although the, uh, the wiggly bit can catch your knuckles a little when you're carrying. But, but I, I like them. They have a lanyard there for you lanyard guys. There's jimping all around the back here. Yeah, real good jimp in there. But there it is, guys. Let's look at the blade size. Just over three and a quarter inches. Uh, cutting edge is three and a quarter inches. And overall length, just over seven and a half inches. Pretty nice. Now my favourite uh, bokeh is this one here. Oh, my favourite, I call them AKs, so the Kalashnikov 74. I like this blade, it's good and pokey, and this one is a Blade Ops exclusive. A bit dirty because I, I use them. And this one's S30V, you can see it down there. I like S30V. I like the feel of it, it always feels silky smooth to me, but um, yeah, this one, blade length, about the same, same as a cleaver, just over three and a quarter there. But uh, this one comes out a little faster because the blade is a little lighter. And we've got another one here to take a little look at. This one's the baby one, the sub sub compact I guess that's what that means and there it is there dinky little thing now this one shoots out like a little rocket <laughs> look at that thing and this one's in D2 I like the blade on this one too very useful this one fits in your fifth pocket real easy real easy now the reason this one shoots out faster than the other two is just the sheer weight of the blade um, Bigger, heavier blade, the spring, which is, these are the springs, I ordered a couple of springs, just in case. And uh, the springs are all the same, they're all standard. So your, your little knife here is carrying the same spring inside as your bigger cleaver blade. So the cleaver moves slower, and the little one, like a little rocket. And this one is in between speed. This one's just about perfect, I think. Real snappy. Snappy enough. You can upgrade your springs if you want to, but I wouldn't go too wild with strength for speed because the pin that's in there, that's what stops the, the blade. 
yeah and uh, aluminum handles like I said so if you put in a super strong spring and it's going to hit that pin harder and you got more chance of it uh, of the pin becoming loose as it pushes back into the aluminum a bit but just keep them stock is what I do and uh, yeah I like them great fun knives very functional really nice to be able to operate a knife with one hand especially for people that have hand injuries all of this automatic knife laws are total old antiquated well out of date law in my opinion because let's face it we've got flippers that flick out as fast as this as faster than this even uh, so makes no difference yeah we got a civivi <laughs> big old cleaver here now this thing oh if i get my knives out the way this thing comes out just as quick yeah so the old antiquated law i think they brought it in in the us uh, to do with gangs new york gangs and all that they were using autos but of course that's all outdated now they're all using they're all carrying firearms <laughs> but this is a new one pretty cool i like that bulbous front there just something different and a little snappy sub california legal because california insists on carrying if you're carrying them it has to be two inches or below yeah two inch maximum and this creeps in at just just under two inches there but um yeah there you go Thanks for watching. Have a great Friday. Have a great weekend. And we'll catch you later. Catch you later, guys.